Just wanted to do a quick video on this. Just got this line in recently. It is fake nickel copper brake line. It was advertised as nickel copper alloy. Easy bendable and all that, but that is not the case. When I got it, what, what kind of tipped me off was the bag had some rust stains in a circle on the inside, and I thought, hmm, that's a little odd. I've used probably 100 feet of the real NICOP stuff over the years, so I'm definitely well familiar with using it, cutting it, flaring it, all that. And I quickly grabbed a magnet, and sure enough, it was steel. I guess if the price is too good to be true, it probably is. There's a junk speaker magnet. It'll pick the whole bag up with the hardware in there and everything. So, grab some sandpaper. Sand to the side of it, and you can see it's a silver underneath like a copper plating. Real nickel copper brake line is not silver. It is the same... Um, coppery looking color all the way through or this here it's just the outsides plated you can see the insides also silver so very misleading very deceptive and after I purchased this and after I found this out I went back and looked and seen they revised the listing because they were still selling the stuff mind you a lot of people had bought this um, before I did and it had a note that it was copper plated where I checked the listing that I purchased and it had no mention of that anywhere so just beware check it out with a magnet magnet will not stick to real nickel copper brake line if a magnet sticks it's steel and that's not what you wanted so <clears throat> real nickel copper brake line will get a little bit of green corrosion but it doesn't rust um, yeah I just thought I'd make a video on that because Apparently there's some fake stuff out there. If it's really cheap, there's a chance it's probably just steel with a plating on it.